Hello and welcome back to Builder Mint. In our last episode, we finished our setup for the nuclear fuel cells, and we have those getting right now sent along to the lab. I don't think we're actually using them for any research, even though we might be, but we do have research to turn in, so let's take care of that real quick. Ah, the turbocharger's finally finished there. Maybe it was the concrete actually we were waiting for there. We need to step that up as part of our next project. Were we actually using the nuclear fuel cells anywhere? No, I didn't think so. So it, it could very well be, at least we, uh, we'll find out soon enough, if they're used in any of these later products we haven't unlocked yet. Quantum entanglers, particle glue, those types of things. Although it looks like no. Um, and if not, then we can figure out how exactly we want to use those for boosting with the nuclear power plants. Until then, though, we are started working on figuring out what we needed to make the next thing, which is atomic locators. Uh, we already looked at this recipe. We're going to make one of these. Uh, because the six supercomputers is kind of our limiting factor here, given that's how we're ma how many we're making. So we're going to make three of the atomic locators, which means we need six electronic microscopes. So we started digging into that recipe, and we have yet to look at making more concrete or this copper wire, which I realized was here just a little bit ago as I was preparing to record and checking these recipes and taking some notes so that I don't have to um, refer back to this all the time. Uh, while we're while we're working on projects um, because that's going to impact a little bit here and then we have this and for this we needed seven and a half nano wire times uh, not quite two but like 1.6 which ends up being 12 nano wire and we went to look at that and then 30 electromagnets which is 48 actually uh, condenser lenses 24 and the metal frames 12 of those as well we're gonna have to make all of these things, uh, and we're going to boost nano wire. So we started uh, looking at nano wire's current production level, and we also started making the electromagnets over here. And so we have now 60 of those, even though we only need 48. And we just built that to scale, but uh, we need a little bit more. Uh, uh, copper wire. In fact, we need another 150 wire. So if we look at this, these each make 60 at 200%. So we're going to need two and a half of these. And two and a half of those is, uh, I guess, something a little bit more than three of those. Um, because two of these is three of those. So it'd be two and a half, uh, which is, um, well, 90 and 90 and 45. So that's 225 and we would need four of these four of these to make uh, that which is fine which means we need to have 225 ore now 225 ore if we coal boost it it's going to be uh, 18 times uh, per node that is were we actually doing this math based on 15 or 18 now I can't remember uh, we have 30 extractors uh, we have the need for three, six, nine times 60. Nine times 60 is 540 divided by 30 extractors, 18. Okay, we were planning on 18, uh, so we will need to coal boost this to get full performance out of this. But since we need another 225, divide that by 18, that means we need another 12 and a half extractors. How many nodes do we have down here? 15, 16 nodes. Oh, that's perfect. That couldn't have gone any better than I, well, not perfect, but couldn't have gone any better if I tried. Uh, so we need to find 12 of these. Maybe we'll do these 12, although maybe not exactly. Um, let's do this one for sure, as well as at least this many here, or maybe this many here, that many. That's 10, 11, 12, those ones there. Build, go. Uh, those need to go on to a belt, exactly one belt, because we're going to coal boost these, probably not nuclear boost them. Uh, this will go this way, this will go that way. This one can go either way, but I think it'll go this way somehow. Uh, let's take this up and over and around and down for reasons. And then that'll go maybe this way, actually. Uh, one more. That can turn this way then. this These two can come up there and there. You can be rotated. You'll need to have a belt there as well. You can be rotated to go there, and you can be rotated to go, oopsie, there. And then that'll just dump into, what did I say, four of these. And we're just going to put all this stuff right in here. Uh, four of these going into what's effectively three of these. Uh, four to three is a little bit more painful. 
So I think what I will do is I will do a, um, a three to two and then a one to one. I think that'll be a little bit easier uh, on the, the balancer math system here. And it'll work out fine as long as I force as much as possible into these first three and then let the overflow go into the fourth. And that's easily enough done. Oh, they need this one too. Uh, we'll go up and around like that, I think. Um, and I think that's easily enough done just by making that one the last split it, splitted? Yeah, well, the English uh, item like that. That way, this one gets um, 50, 25, 12 and a half, and 12 and a half. And then it'll be fine, I think. Uh, if not, well, um, what could we do? I don't know. So, well, hopefully that's enough. Uh, that'll make those, and that'll make these, and then we just need to have a belt coming off of these, like so, with the copper wire on it. And that'll go over there as well. Uh, we had another thing done. Yeah, another thing. Good. Ah, finally, turbocharger's finished here. So we have the workshop tier four upgrade, which is kind of good because that lets me go up to the 300% tier on those if we so choose. Uh, so back to nanowire. We were talking at the end of the last episode about how to handle this upgrade. And I think the least bad way to do this um, is to not try and do a four, four to three thingy here. Um, as we kind of just warranted that it's kind of a pain in the neck to do a four to three. Um, at least I think it would be. I actually haven't really thought about it other than what we did here. Um, which actually isn't so bad either. That isn't so bad. We could do that again, but I don't think that's really necessary here. Uh, instead, what we could do is just upgrade these to whatever their tier four is, whether it's 400% or 300%, because our limiting factor is going to be this anyway. Uh, the workshops and so if these are running at 100% faster than those well not 100% faster but 33% uh, faster than those no big deal they're just not going to run all the time who cares uh, we already have I think the ability to upgrade our miners uh, extractors to we only get 300% out of them anyway right now so that should be fine and then also uh, these here we can get 300% out of those these are workshops, we're good there. These here, we cannot get 300% out of yet. So we can't quite produce the coal and, uh, or sorry, the graphite we want yet until we get tier three, uh, sorry, tier four forges, which comes with, nope, comes with those supercomputers that are trickling in. So I think by the time we're ready to use more of this nano wire, we'll be okay. Uh, in the meantime, though, we need to make sure that this is even going to be enough. We're currently making 10. That's at 200%. So 300% will be 15. 15 times 3 is 45. And we're currently using down here somewhere in the neighborhood of 20. Uh, it might be a, sh a shade over 20. So we'll call it 22 and a half. Because I know it's not that much. Uh, because, well, these are using 24. Um... Uh, the logic circuits, and we're not making that many logic circuits. I think we're making... Well, actually, uh, we're giving it two-thirds of this. And here we're making two-thirds of... What is that? 54? 54 times 2 divided by 3 is 36. No way. There's no way 36 are going that way. We're not making that many. Uh, not possible. Looks like we're short on, possibly on this, since that's not backed up and the wire is. Why are we short on stone stuff? Plus, we could also step this up to tier three, if we so chose, which we might so choose. Uh, it means we got to trace this back. Uh, you all are 29 times, right now it's not boosted. 29 times 15, but it could be, or sorry, is it 15? No, 11.25. Uh, but it's not because it's not boosted yet. You all are processing 54 times 8 of that. 11.25 uh, times, I just forgot the number, Wally. Dang it. 15? 29. That's totally wrong. Times 29. 326 and a quarter. You all are processing that as a one to one. And then it's going into here boosted, which we want to eventually change. Um, down two-thirds of that. So divided by three times. Oops. Divided by three. 
times two. 217 and a half of wire. And you all need... I mean, this is also currently coal boosted, even though we don't want it to be forever, I don't think. Uh, you're consuming 54 per. Um, so if I divide that by 54, multiply by 18, which is another, two, uh, another one third, 72 and a half. But I was thinking we were making 18 times five, which is 90. Wait, did I say that right earlier? Whatever. Uh, we're making 72 and a half. So I have two thirds of it going this way. We're not making two thirds. We're definitely not making 72 and a half. Uh, to make 72 and a half of these, I need double that in silicon, which is 145. The silicon here, is, to make 145 uh, divided by 36 is just over four. We have six of them. Interesting, interesting. Must have been a balancing thing when I was doing here. Um, probably for the belt speed thing, maybe. Maybe I was intending on boosting these and didn't. That could be. That could be. That's Maybe that's why we're short on the stone. Because I don't have a booster in here. Hmm. I don't think we need the boosters. So, with stone, we can always just add more. We have so much stone. Unless we're going to use a lot of it in the end here. Uh, it's kind of ridiculous. Uh, so, if we're making one... F if we're using 145 of sand, then we're using the same amount of stone. And here we have tier one extractors. That's probably actually the problem. Uh, seven and a half times 27 is two, no, it's 202 and a half. Okay, I'm confused. Did I screw something up somewhere? Oh, sorry, that's the silicon we needed. The silicon then doubles again. Uh, 145 times two is 290. Yeah, these should have been tier twos. Uh, or, yeah, tier twos. Uh, that's um, 290 divided by 27 is 10.7 per miner, and this will give us 11.25. There's our problem. That'll do it. See, that's what happens when you don't do your upgrades throughout the whole stream, folks. Mind those upgrades. But yeah, I think in this situation, we would just add more. We wouldn't ever probably coal boost the stone. We potentially would coal boost the copper so that we can get as much out of it as possible. But we wouldn't coal boost the, the factories because, well, there's not a whole lot of point in coal boosting the factories, just add more. Uh, the resources are our uh, limitation here. So this should fix the problem, um, assuming that these, which there are seven, won't overflow this, which they will, but only a little bit. And these, which are 20, which is also a problem down the road, won't overflow these four, uh, which... Actually, that won't overflow those. I lied because I didn't add those together. Uh, 4 times 72 is 288 divided by 20 is 14.4. Yeah, we can we can handle this just fine. Okay, that should add a little bit more to the logic circuits, which means that uh, if we're making... What the heck was an original number there? 72 and a half. Technically, I don't need to do this overflow push this way uh, we still can or I could even just push them into here instead maybe that's even better than having them run down here that way we don't have a huge belt backup oh no because I'm using them for this right how many do you need you need 34 I should be splitting this in half it shouldn't be the two third one third thing all right let's just go have these uh, that way it's um 72 and a half divided by two is 36.25. So that that way the computers will get enough and these guys will get, oh no, they won't get enough. We're still not making enough of these. Nope. We need to go up to the next tier for this because these should get 48 and we should get 30, however many it was here. Uh, not that. This one? 34 here. 48 and 34 
is 82. Yep, we need to go tier two or tier three, folks. Let's do it. Uh, you here? Tab. Extractors tier three. Workshops tier three. Furnaces tier three. And machine shops tier three. That adds another 50% to base. So if I take this 72 and a half, so I'm going to redo all the math from, from zero, uh, divided by three times four. Uh, because going from 150 to 200 is a 4 to 3 ratio, a 3 to 4 ratio. That puts us at 96.67, uh, which is a much better number than um, than 72 and a half. Yeah. Uh, and then let's do this here too. Tab. Tier 3. Tier... Oopsie. Tier 3. Tier 3. Assuming everything is good, which I suspect it may or may not be. Uh, we may have belt speed issues here, for example, because I was putting 20 on a belt. Um, right now, our speed is 15. 15 times 20 is... That should be good, actually. 300. So, yeah, that's actually fine. It's only when you're cold boosting and you're at 400% that it's actually a potential problem in the, uh, down the road. Um, but this should be good. So... Back to work now. So this being at half, since we're pushing 96 now, uh, 96 divided by two is 48. So that's exactly the amount we need to go this way. And that means we will indeed be using all uh, 24 nano wire, which means that we of course need to upgrade this as previously discussed. So we're gonna go up to tier three, tier four on this, which puts us to, um, 60 which will be enough because we're going to need 12 nano wire plus 12 and 12 plenty plenty of nano wire all right uh that gives us yeah we have a few extra to work with so let's upgrade this to tier three tier four excuse me uh these as well and um those are at 400%, which is fine. And then as soon as these are ready, uh, we'll upgrade them as well. We do seem to keep keep that in mind. I'm spending some money now. Uh, let's see. You all are up here. And then these ones are all of these over here. And... This whole patch up here. Well, I did do coal boosting on this stone patch, but I think that was for similar numbers for the whole recipe. Um, so that should do it once we can get this up here upgraded. For now, it's just going to be uh, running a little bit at a shortfall, um, but I think that's okay. Uh, it'll just it'll just be this will be our our uh, limitation with. Um, 30 times 4 graphite. Sorry, 30 times 8 graphite, 240. Going down to... Um, something tells me that's not actually 22. Uh, can I tell by without, without going into it? I don't feel like doing that kind of weird math. I think it's some um, 22 and a half. Uh, so... 240 divided by 4 would be only, well, two of these. Two of these is 60. This needs 90, so this going to be running at two-third speed. So we're running about 15, which means that uh, we'll have 60 uh, divided by 3 is 20. So we're going to be running at two-thirds speed here, which is exactly there, of course. Uh, so we're still going to be running at 10. That's, the, that's everything there was to ratio. I couldn't remember without doing math. So excuse that if you don't mind, um, but yeah, we're, we should be we should be good now. Okay, so um, we'll just have to as this gets ramped up, we'll have to take uh, some off of this somehow and and split it. But we'll have to figure that splitter out uh, somewhere down the road. So beyond all of that, we have electromagnets. We have um, we have wire. We need to work on metal frames, concrete and condenser lenses. Um, condenser lenses, I think we're here. They need uh, glass, 
Um, in order to make 24 condenser lenses, we're going to have to run... Uh, well, we're running this at... Tier 2. So at Tier 2, it'll be just one machine. Because uh, one machine will make 30 at Tier 2. If it makes 20 at Tier 1. Which means we need to have uh, 90 glass. Glass is made at a furnace. Uh, 90 glass at tier 2 means we need to have 6 of them. Um, actually, you know what? Let's step this. Let's step all this math down so I don't do all the math every time. Uh, if we needed, at tier 2, 24 condenser lenses, that means we need 16 um, at tier 1. Uh, just to make my math a little bit easier here. Which means we need one of these, not even fully, but we'll call it. Which means 60 glass. 60 glass means 6 of these, which is... 240 sand. 240 sand comes back to this one, which is here, and that means we need six of these, which is 240 stone. 240 stone at tier two is. Many nodes would that be? At 18, 240 is. Uh, 13 and a third extractors. I think that's. Okay. Uh, sorry, that's eight. That's that with eighteen though. That's um, that's eleven and eleven point two five. So actually, let's do. No, it's not even that either. Seven and a half times one point five times one point two for coal boosting. If we do coal boosting, it's thirteen and a half. Two forty divided by thirteen and a half is seventeen point seven eight. Eighteen extractors. Do we have eighteen nodes here? We have thirteen. Do we have some number of nodes up here? That's 15. Well, we could combine some from each of those patches. Since they're all both partially used, I think that would make the most sense. Uh, this was 13. We'll use 12 from there uh, and 6 from here. Or we could get 5 from here and belt them down, mix it with that 13th and do this all right here. Given that we're supposed to be going into there, that's not a bad idea. That's not a bad idea. Um, I think we're supposed to coal boost this too, but I'm not positive on that. So let's um, let's do that. So we need to have. Are you all tier your tier threes? Um, let's do tier two uh, workshops. Making. Sand. Six of those. Wait a minute. I did 240 at tier one. I need 240 at tier one. I almost screwed this up. <sighs> at least I. So it's two. F it's seven and a half times 1.2. 240 divided by nine. 27. That's a little bit more. That means we're going to need most of both of these patches, which is still fine. Uh, maybe I do this, though, a bit up here more, since it's kind of in between then. Um, that's going to be basically all of what's left of both these patches. And I probably only want to put 12 still on a belt because of the previously discussed math of um, maximum belt speed of 480, but possible maximum extractor speed of... Assuming we don't nuclear boost it, uh, seven and a half times four times 1.2, uh, 36, 480 divided by 36 is 13.333. Um, seven and a half times four times 1.4, 480 divided by 42 is 11.42. So if we nuclear boost, we have to knock it down to 11 extractors per belt. Until we do, we can go 12 or 13. We're going to go with 12, though, because 12 is also kind of matching, I think, the numbers we need uh, more closely than 13 will. So if we're going to have 12 extractors per belt, uh, 12 times 9 is 108. I guess it doesn't really match the numbers that well. That's three of these, though. Um, so we can do that. And then those will go directly into furnaces, uh, doing the same uh, ratio here. Class, because it's, uh, yeah, 40, uh, 40 out from here, 
40 into here, or 40, yeah, 40 into there. So group of three takes care of 120 at a time. Spits out not quite 30 uh, at base. Um, 108 divided by 120 times 30, 27. That'll work. And then those 27 will go into another workshop in some fashion, making the lenses. Uh, you need 60. So two of these will go into one of these. These will operate then at, oopsie, at 50, uh, or taking in 54, which means that they will operate at uh, 18. Now to go back to this recipe um, for the lenses, we need 10 lenses for each one of these, and we're only doing 1.6 of these, so we need 16 lenses at base. Um, is that right? Did I screw something up along the way here? May have. May have. No, that one of these will spit out 18. I mean, 16 total lenses. Okay. So I need two of these. Yep. I need two of these. Um, one of those. Which means that I need actually... 24 extractors. Not whatever math I did before that I can't remember now. This is, this is a little bit confounding, but it is kind of what it is. Uh, uh, 27. I only need 24 because we're actually shorting these just a little bit. We're shorting them by about one extractor per, um, per set. So that makes some sense, I guess. I think. I don't know. So let's, let's upgrade these to uh, all tier twos, just to make sure that the math is still kosher here. Uh, the workshop needs to output 1 point, uh, wait, condenser lenses, it needs to output 24 condenser lenses. So that needs to operate at, is that 24 divided by 30, 80%, which means we need 80% of 90 glass times 90, 72 glass. Glass is being made at a rate of 15, so 72 divided by 15 means we need 4.8 of those. I'm going to be making 6 of those. Just because I think of, uh, because of ratios. Um, which means we need 4 times that number of uh, sand. 4.8 times 60 is 288 sand and that means we need 288 stone and 288 stone if you're going with a tier 2 extractor uh, that's boosted uh, then we, we take 288 divided by seven and a half times 1.5 times 1.2 which is 13 and a half 288 divided by 13 and a half is only 22 extractors I don't know. I think I'm going to do 24 extractors, 12 each going into this. That way it's 12 times 13.5, uh, which is 162. That's not right. Something's not right here. I've screwed something up somewhere along the way. Um, somewhere along the way I've screwed something up. 40, that was 120, and I was doing... Seven and a half times one point two, which is nine. Twelve times nine is one oh eight. Okay, I was doing it. I'm just not sure what I've done weird. I've confused myself somehow. 
I think I just said I don't I actually don't need 12 extractors and I said I'm just gonna shove 12 of them into there so I have a little bit of extra glass short story long we'll have a little bit extra glass uh, so we need to have 12 from here and 12 from up up north uh, that'll be fine we could take this one or not maybe I'll just skip it we'll just do 12 and 12 um, because I think that'll make my life easier so let's move these somewhere here this be like in the middle we copy this um do something like actually we could just do it like this like that and then we bring 12 extractors worth of stone into each one of those all right shut up wally shut up and build wally build space tab tier two and right now they're running at 11.25 they'll be 13 and a halves eventually Sixty-two divided by one eighty is ninety percent. Okay, it's it's right. It's right. I just got myself tied up. No problem. There and there, there. You can go this way. Somehow, some way, somewhere, over the rainbow. Um, why don't we do something like this and then like this, and you can turn around. You can go. Actually, you could go like this. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. Okay. That'll go this way. And I think I will go under and then parallel till we get to not quite that far. There. Uh, I guess I need to have some splitters here like this and that. Like this and that. Belt there and there. This belt comes out like this and goes into there. And then also this belt comes out from there and those get merged together. Those each have some fraction of 15 on them times six, uh, equating out to be some less than 90, which is fine then. All right, so you can go in there. We can get those kind of started. We can get from the other side now, 12 of these. Nine, ten. I'd like to pick that one up. Eleven, twelve. So we'll still have three of these left. Build space, uh, tab, upgrade, go. This one, there, there, up, up, there, there. You can come down like this and around somehow. Maybe even just ending there. Uh, you all can do this. You can do that. No, stay there. You can go here. You can go down and then over like this. Like that, and then like that. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. This goes down, mostly straight down. Resetting the sound. Oh, is that close to perfect or what? Uh, we'll just do that. I guess I could have pushed him back. You know what? We still could. Just to be completely wasteful, sure. Uh, there. I mean, completely wasteful in that all the product that had been made was lost, but that's fine. So those will truck over to this. That's cond uh, condenser lenses. Uh, and 24 of them is what we needed. You know why we talked about electromagnets we have, condenser lenses we have, lenses we have metal frames. Back to the metal frames. Uh, we're going to need to have 12 metal frames at the boosted, so 8 at the uh, at the level 1. Means 2 of these, but not even that much. Iron plating in wood frames. So these don't need steel, these need iron plating. Uh, right? Uh, iron plating in wood. And if we're going to make eight of these, we need 40 iron plates and 10 wood. We're not making 10, but 40 iron plates and 10 wood. Uh, iron plates are made in a workshop, I think. Iron plate. 40 iron plates means 80 iron ingots, and 80 iron ingots means 80 iron. 80 iron at 9 means 
Uh, not quite 10 extractors of iron. It's actually nine extractors of iron. Uh, nine being the boosted. If I have 12 here, for example, I could steal those, steal some of this wood, and we could make iron plates right here in the middle. That works for me. Nine extractors. Eight. Uh, not that one. Do these two instead. Build space. All right. Um, let's do... I should have actually upgraded those while I was in there. Uh, ingots, plates, and... There we go. Copy. Come over here. You and you going into there. Uh, with respect to that... Let's do somewhere in there. Uh, you're good, sort of. You're not, sort of. Ingots. And then you are good, too. Uh, we need to make the wood frames, though, as well. So we'll figure that part out. Uh, let's see. You're taking in 40, making 20. You're making 30. Three to four ratios again. Uh, move over here. All right, let's go to tier two, just because that's the level we're working at. Tier two, tier two. 12 metal frames means two of these. Uh, not fully running at full speed, but if we did full speed, then that would be 15. That means 60 iron plates, which would mean two of these fully. Well, that's uh, easily enough accomplished with two of those, two of these. And those each need, need then... Uh, each need 60 iron ingots. 60 iron ingots is one and a third of each of these. So we could do three of these. Uh, let's do copy like this. And then split the middle one and bring in... Um, 120 ore instead. Uh, that might be a little bit tougher. But we don't even need to bring in 120 ore. Uh, 120 ore at this is... Oh, these gotta be upgraded. Oh, crap. These gotta be upgraded. Uh, these ones. And these ones. Nine. Good. Uh, nine times 13 and a half is actually 120 ore. So that's fine. All right. Uh, so this one would be split, even though it won't necessarily be running at full speed. Um, they'll all be running at 40 instead of 45. That should be fine. Uh, these will be straight in like that. These will go here then, and that'll be good. And then these will go straight into those, uh, along with the uh, wood frames. Um... Seven and a half per minute wood frames. Are they made in this as well? No, those are made in a workshop, I think. There they are. Wood frames has been a while. Uh, make... I think it's 11.25. Oh, we got a thing to up take upgrade, upgrade, upgrades. There's the forge. La Forge. Let's go take a... Take a quick detour up here to upgrade these to tier... Uh, four to get a little bit more out of those. This stuff is all backed up. This stuff is waiting on more of those. So, good. Back to our project here. I think that's 11.25. Um, I think it's 7.5 times 1.5, which is 11.25. That would make logical sense. So we need a little bit more than one of these. Uh, at this ratio, you know what, hold on. Let's, I think that's a 4x ratio, I think. Yeah. Um, so we need four times 15, 60 planks. Those are made in a workshop as well. 60 planks is gonna be three of these. Yeah, which means we need 60 logs in. Uh, move. 
remove. Copy that. 60 logs at tier 2 extractors is uh, 13 and a half each if we coal boost it. Let's assume we are. 60 divided by 13 and a half is just over 4. 5 uh, to be specific at this speed. Uh, if we added the sixth one, we wouldn't have to coal boost, but I think we'll probably just coal boost it. Don't have any there. Uh, at least eventually. But we have also we have plenty of wood too, so we probably will never. Let's just do let's just do six. That way we don't have to worry about it. Uh, build space tab tier two. Uh, that was five. One two three four. Well, I can't count. Build. Space, tab, tier two. Uh, that'll be more than enough, and that makes me happy. Uh, you guys... I guess that's fine. That'll be fine. This belt is going to come across here someplace. I would like to have this belt end up right next to it somewhere. In a straight line. In a straight line. There we go. So we're going to want to build this basically in the same manner as this. There. Move that there. Uh, the wood will come in from up here. Iron's going to come in from down there. So wood there. Iron here. These go here. If I can be a little bit creative with this that might happen um if you went straight into there then you would have to come down to the bottom one that's possible if you went straight into there then you'd have to go up to the top one that's also possible uh, let's try that in practicality uh, so this one is going into the bottom so this one needs to go into the bottom this one is going into the top so this one needs to go into the top although kind of not really but not really enough um, I think I want one more space here. Oopsie. One more space means that I can do an underground here and then route this one in here. And then these can go straight across, which I need to do as an underground as well. Like that. So you're getting wood and metal. And you're getting metal and wood. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Could I have done that better? Probably. But I like it. Okay, so am I going to have a problem here? No, I don't think so, because this will go there, this will go there. We'll have splitters here and here, here and here, and all will be well. Uh, let's see, wood then needs to come down and across here. Which is going to be a little bit of a problem with this being there. If I could, I would move this whole thing down to there, which I think I could do. Just move down two spaces. Move down to here-ish. That would be fine. And then coming up from here, I didn't run these belts yet. Uh, up, up, that way, maybe this way. Uh, up here like this. Come in like this. Straight lines, Wally. Like that, maybe. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine. All connected? Sure. Here? Yeah, you're good with whatever I do. Okay, good. Let's come back over here then. Bring this down. Too far, slightly. And then here, I gotta build this one manually. Underground to there. This one's fine to drag. Into there. And then you can go in like this, and out should pop. Oh, hey, you're backing up. Oh, good, you're backing up. Good that you're backing up. Out should pop metal frames. I hope. 
That takes care of condenser lenses, metal frames, nano wire we talked about, and electromagnets we talked about. Wire we have here as well, and then concrete. Uh, concrete's recipe, base recipe, is... Steel and sand. We need to have uh, 72 concrete upgraded. These will produce 11.25 upgraded. So we need 6.4, we'll call that seven of these. Um, where are we at with needing more concrete elsewhere though? If we don't, then I'll probably just make the bare minimum. If we're still ticking away on concrete somewhere else, then I want to know about it. Or if we still need it somewhere else, I want to know about it. It looks like we finally might be done with depend independent concrete here. If that's the case, and it appears to be... Yeah, because we finished this one. Then we don't need any more. So seven forges. Uh, we can do the math from there. Uh, then sand is made in a workshop. And then we can steal the steel rods. Uh, we needed 72 steel rods, though. How many were we making down here? That's a lot of steel rods. We're not making that many. We're only making 60 here. And we're using some relatively small number of them for this. 12. So we need another 30 something, call it 36 steel rods. Now, which means we need more iron. Uh, we need more wood and more coal. Would we have, I forgot we were getting the coal from all the way up here. Uh, coal we don't there. Uh, we're gonna need to almost double this. Is it, wait, is 72 the right number? Steel rods. Double check that, Molly. Uh, where am I at? I've lost it. There we are. Forge. Concrete. If we need 72 concrete, which we do, that is 72, not 7.2. Wow, that's obscene. Okay. Then we need 72 steel rods. It's a one-to-one -one there between those two and a ridiculous amount of sand. There's where we're gonna use the sand at, is in the, is in the concrete, uh, the, so the stone. Um, so we need to double this steel build here. We need to add another one of these. However, we already have one, more or less. Somewhere, up here. Um, we already have some. Do we still need this steel for anything else? Just making concrete and being sold. And I did not see steel being sold anywhere else. How much are we making here? This is uh, tier three. So we're making 18 steel times six. And down here, I think these are also tier three, right? And it was steel rods. 18 times 12. Um, steel rods are reducing that number to at a three ratio. So divided by three, uh, 72. <sighs> we need 12 more steel rods than what we have right now. Uh, capability of right now. I'm making one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight here. I'm only making, wait a minute, wait a minute. I only did, Eighteen times twelve. It's eighteen times fourteen. I think we might just barely have enough. Eighteen times fourteen divided by three is eighty-four. That is barely enough. So this all would get turned into steel rods, 
And instead of it going directly to this concrete making here, it would get mixed with this, wherever the heck it is, ridiculously backing up steel rod belt here, uh, and would get passed along to be merged in, in here. I think we can do this. I think we can do this, but I think we're gonna have to do this next time because that's a little bit more than we have time for today. This is kind of two products in one build. We haven't needed the other one yet. So we're kind of, um, you know, focused on, you know, making two things at once. We basically have one of them ready to go. That is the electron microscopes. We just haven't hooked it up. And instead we are waiting until we have everything that, that is gonna need it for the atomic locators and just hook those up directly. And I think we should be able to do that. This is probably gonna get pushed over there. That's probably gonna get pushed up there. Those will get merged together to go into one of those inputs along with the other three things. Uh, so I think what we'll do next time is we will reroute this belt a little bit here so that the gears are going out a little bit further. We can merge these into a couple of um, workshops making rods locally here instead of them getting sent up here. We can disable this concrete, which means also this sand uh, making. Um, we can either flush it into uh, into here, put it back as, as glass and flush it into here just to sell it or delete it entirely, probably just gonna sell it. We're at 2.2 million, but we can always go further. Uh, we'll let this kind of run out of what it's got in terms of the steel rods and the sand that it's taking, delete it, and then basically move this concrete build uh, to be a bespoke concrete build, maybe somewhere in this area nearby here. Um, merge those in with these, most of these here. If we split this half here, it, these will get their 12 and the other, 80? No, 40. Uh, the rest of the 40 will continue along and get merged in down here with the other rods. Those rods will come together uh, along with some stone. Maybe we use this stone here. Uh, maybe we end up using this stone to make the concrete uh, with still. Um, however many extractors we're going to need. I haven't done, we haven't done the math on that yet. I'll have that ready for next time. And then we will take that, uh, that sand, that stone, uh, into whatever steel build we do down here. Uh, even if we have to add some of this in and then we can, um, we can make ourselves some atomic locators. We're nearly there folks. One more episode or next episode, I think we'll have it. And then we, from there can, um, can move on to whatever's next, which I think is going to be, uh, industrial frames, which are going to need even more concrete. Oh boy. As well as metal frames and tungsten carbide. Oh boy. We're going to have to make more steel in that case. All right. We'll see what happens next time then. Thank you all for joining me and I will see you then. Bye for now.